Traverse City is Tuesday, April 25th. Welcome to Gator Nation News. I'm Callie. And I'm Addie. So, Addie, long time no see. Yes, I know everyone here has missed me quite of a bit. <laughs> <laughs> so, where have you been? I've been showing my pig for the last week <laughs> at the county fair, and I got first in my class, which is really exciting. Okay, congratulations, Addie. Thank you, thank you, everyone. Anyway. Is there anything else that you got from it? Oh, yeah, I won a buckle, and I sold my pig for $3,500. Okay, Miss Future Farmer. Future Farmer of America. Yep. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Today is the first day to download the first two free audiobooks from Audiophile Sync. You must have the Sora app on your phone. Once you've downloaded the books, they are yours to keep. You don't have to listen to the books from the week April 27th to May 3rd, but you do have to download the audiobooks one of those days. Stop by the library and we can answer any questions you have or check with your English teacher. Enjoy! <laughs> Come on is seeking high school sophomores, juniors, seniors, and or parents in the community that are looking for part-time work or volunteer hours to support students along their Kumon journey. Kumon is an after-school math and reading supplemental education program. The early learner assistant and greater positions are great opportunities to gain some valuable experience while helping others in our community. If you're interested, you can email LeagueCitySouth underscore Texas at iKumon.com or call 832-895-1233 for an interview. The senior office will be selling water bottles for $1 to raise more funds for prom. The DHS Dance Department Spring Showcase, The Beat Goes On, will be on April 28th and 29th in the DHS Auditorium at 6 p.m. Pre-sale tickets are $10 and $12 at the door. Cypress Creek Renewables is offering scholarships for high school seniors in Galveston County who are interested in solar energy and STEM related fields. The deadline to apply is May 5th. The Baxter and Woodman Scholarship Fund was founded to assist students pursuing a career in the civil engineering field. It is Baxter and Woodman's hope that the funds will support incoming college freshmen who are determined to achieve greatness in the civil engineering field and who will ultimately utilize their high level of skill, talent, and professionalism to serve the community. Scan the QR code to apply. The deadline to apply is Friday, April 28th by 5 p.m. Make sure to follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube at Gator Nation Media and on Twitter at Gator Nation Live for the latest news and live updates. And if you're a staff member with interesting stories or information you want on Gator Nation News, make sure to send them to our email at gnmedia at dickensisd.org. That's all the news we have for you today. Now for the inspirational quote. For generations, philosophers have asked, if a tree falls in the forest and no one is around to hear it, does it make a sound? The answer, by the way, obviously, is of course it does. I mean, duh, right? Philosophers, get a job, thingy boy. Dr. Heinz Stephensburg <laughs> said that. Gator Nation News will be br taking a brief hiatus the rest of the week to record the Gator Music Festival on location at McAdams. But we'll see you next week on Gator Nation News. And now for the fun fact of the day. Did you know researchers once turned a live cat into a telephone? Princeton researchers Ernest Weaver and Charles Bray took out a cat's skull and most of its brain to connect the animal to electricity. When they spoke into the cat's ear, the sound could be heard through the receiver in another room. This experiment paved the way for collicular implant development. That's it for today.